Hi, welcome to Terribly Accurate. These are your cards of the day today. Now today we have some very powerful messages and the reason I say that is because we start with um, Archangel Gabriel who is known as the messenger, right? He's um, a super, super popular angel, very important in Christianity as well as Islam. Um, now with this card, this is about you know, as the messenger, being open to receive messages from God, Allah, spirit guides, angels. Um, it's very important that we're available to hear what God is trying to tell us, what the universe is trying to tell us so that we can make best decisions and have our happiest life, right? Now we're going to come back to that card. And the reason why we're skipping around here is because our color energy of the day is lavender, okay? Now it says connect to the mind, body, and soul. So we can receive messages mentally. Some of us are claircognizant. We can get them in our body. Maybe you're clairsentient. Um, you know, our soul connects to the divine. We are of divinity. We are God's children, right? We are made in his likeness. Um, so we really need to just kind of get balanced between um, what's going on with our heart, our mind, our soul, and living our life to our highest purpose. Now, purples are always about our intuition and following our gut instincts, connecting to source and taking those messages, interpreting them, and then following through on the advice that we're given. That's what we want to do today with this lavender color. So I'm going to read you the affirmation um, for today with lavender. It says, Divine Spirit, strengthen my connection to my own divinity and allow me to see the divinity in other people. Now, speaking of other people, we're going to come back to our card, um, Archangel Gabriel. Okay, um, here's the thing. We might feel like when other people reach out to us that we are being taken advantage of in, in certain situations. Um, but we're challenged to give to them anyway, because maybe that's not the case, okay? This card is very much about having good communication with other people, so you can tell them your limits. You can put up your boundaries. But this is a card challenging you to be a philanthropist, okay? To be kind to others, to be there when they need your help, to be a good listener as well, to offer advice. And if you don't have any good advice, it's okay to say that. But um, maybe your advice is to help them to connect to God, Allah, spirit guides, angels, that sort of a thing, okay? Um, we really want to express our love for humanity as Gabriel does today. Now, that being said, um, when other people are different than us, when other people have different life challenges that we don't understand, it's not our job to judge them. And it says, accept the situation as it is rather than trying to fight it. We don't have to convince other people to live their life our way. Everybody is going to do what they want to do in their own time, but we can encourage them to um, seek out a higher power. Does that make sense? Now, here's the thing that's kind of making this reading a little bit strange it's the four of cups and it's in reverse saying that opportunities are there for you like to grow emotionally and to give and show love to other people but either number one you don't see them number two you're just not quite sure that you want to take them but the problem is that if you don't take advantage of these um, opportunities now they may not be available to you later. So it could be an opportunity to create a bond with someone or um, a new friendship to help someone out, okay? So it's kind of an interesting reading and um, I hope that you like it. I hope that it resonates for you today. Maybe the better way to start is with these affirmations so that you can get in your own clear space so that when we attempt to um, take advantage of these opportunities that are offered to us because if we don't today they could go away um, our challenge is you know to accept other people and their circumstances as they are not fighting to change them but maybe offering encouragement and love and support um, oftentimes verbally okay but sometimes it can be with a hug with a loving embrace just saying you know I'm here I understand it could be just a listening ear so uh, love and light not a very um, 
action-packed reading today, but it is one um, that is very important for those of you who need to hear it. So I'll see you tomorrow. Love and light.